Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. I am kind of wanting to minister to some of you who are very angry with God. Sometimes life hits us in such a way where we just don't quite get. What the heck was God thinking? Well, he let that happen. Lord, you said you loved me. Well, how could you say you loved me? I would have done that so much differently. That seems like such a mean way to go through, to, to plan it out. Why would you let it happen like this? They didn't have to die. Why did so-and-so have to get sick? I, I, I just don't get it. I don't get why you allowed my child to go to jail. I don't get it, Lord. I don't understand. How did you allow my daughter to be raped? Where were you when I was raped? Where were you? And we fuss at God and we shake our fist at him, so to speak. Because we are angry with God. And there are times we don't even want to mention his name. Don't talk to me about God. Don't try to get me to go to church. I'm done. I'm done with you, Lord. I'm done with you. But you know what I love about God? Even though you can't see the reasoning behind his wisdom, and in some cases his judgment calls, he's the only one. He knows what he's doing. When we get angry at him, when we walk away from him and say, look God, look, talk to the head, I don't have time for you anymore. I am so sick of hearing your name. God still loves us as we walk away from him. He still loves us when we blame him for things people we love have done to get themselves arrested. We blame, our, we blame God when somebody we love gets raped because of a choice they made. Not that it was right for that to happen, but where else could they have been where that couldn't have even taken a, couldn't even happen. So life happens. We make decisions. Things go wrong. We blame God. I lost a car. I blame God. Five years later after hearing the pity party about that, wondering why, 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 God finally said, you remember that feeling I gave you all day? That was me. I did everything I could to keep you home, to keep you out of that car so you wouldn't have the accident you had. You chose to go out anyway. I mean, God is just so marvelous, but we get angry with him. And you know what I love about God? He understands. He understands. He's not turned off to us for blaming him. He knows it's going to take a little minute for us to really get the picture of what really happened. And then God is sovereign. And even though we don't get it, does not mean he owes us an explanation. But because God is good, we have to remember that everything God does, even if it looks mighty ugly to us, is still a good thing. God 
bless you. Reconcile with him, please. Please. He will help you. And he will heal all of that pain and hurt. 